Well, this is Sean Canan with WMNF News, and I'm going to try to explain here quickly how to convert a Zoom recording into audio in the MP3 format that we can use on the air. Um, I'm sti skipping the first few steps here. What we have is you're looking at the folder that Zoom gives us after we've recorded a Zoom interview. So just a few minutes ago, I recorded a Zoom interview, and uh, before when I set up the interview, I clicked on the box that said record audio and video. And so once it's done, it takes a few minutes to for, for Zoom to render the video, and it gives us these three files. And the file that I'm going to manipulate here is the Zoom dot mp4 that's a video file but it also has audio in it I'm gonna right click on this and open it with um, with VLC media player which is an open source media player I'm pretty sure so all I'm doing right now is I'm opening it and so it's opening a video um, uh, I don't know what that's I'm gonna say no so this is a video of me a few minutes ago um, getting ready for the interview yeah that's embarrassing um, so this is the video, but I want to extract audio from this. So what I'm going to do is go to media, click on media, click on convert slash save. And now what I want to do is I want to find this um, file and I'm going to click add. Now, this isn't the file. It looks the same as before, but I am noticing that the name of the file is different this is the last one I converted. So what I'm going to do is go up a directory. Zoom stores all the videos in a, in a particular directory and so you need to know where this is on the file uh, on your computer. And bad form here, you'll notice in the other interviews I did I gave it a, descriptive, a, a description when I set up the Zoom file. I, I accidentally didn't do it this time so it just says my meeting. That's bad form. I would when you're setting up a Zoom interview, I would definitely give it a description that has some meaning, like the name of the person you're interviewing and the topic. This one doesn't, um, but I will open that to find the three files that we just saw a minute ago. And here's the file that we're talking about. So I'm gonna click on that and then click open. And so now it's selected here. The next step I want to do is convert slash save. So I click on that. Now I want to make sure that it's an MP3 because that's what I want to convert this to. I want to convert this video file to an MP3, so we're good there. Now here's a, the next step. I go to destination file and I'm going to find where I want this to save. And this is important because you want to have good organization. Um, you don't want to save it in this file because this is some Zoom file that you'll never gonna, you're never going to use. I've created a, the file where I do all my work and that's, I call it the working folder, you can call it whatever. I have things arranged by date, here's today's date, and I'm going to create a folder that's, I'll just call it Coral Interview. I just did an interview about corals and so I'm going to open that and I'm going to save it here. So now it, it's in today's date and Coral Interview, this is where I'm saving this audio file. So it's really important to know where you're saving things. Otherwise, all these files look the same and you'll never find them. Now I want to name this file, so I want to give it a name that means something. So raw audio Coral Interview dot mp3. We're saving this as an mp3. I want to make sure that it's saving as an mp3 and I'll hit save. We're not done yet. Now I've got the file that I, the video file that I'm going to convert into what audio file, and now I have to start the conversion. So I click start, and you can look down here at uh, the counter here, and you can see that it's going through the whole file. This is an eight-minute file, and it does it very quickly. It's going to do it in a few seconds, and now it's converting that eight-minute file into an eight-minute audio file. Almost done. It's done now. All right. So now the only other thing I have to do is find. The, um, the audio. Well, I know exactly where it is because I told it where, it, where to go. And so I'm going to go to um, my working folder and I saved it in 8.5 and it's in Coral Interview. There we go, raw audio Coral Interview.mp3. And then I can just open this by dragging it into Audition, which is off the screen. It's on a different screen. And now it will open up as an MP3. Uh, <laughs> cameo by my cat but it opens up as an mp3 in Audition. That's how you save a video file that was recorded by Zoom into an mp3 file. This is Sean Canan with WMNF. Thanks.